So welcome back to part two of my canopy build and as you can see I have finished put on the hinge for the door panel and about to do the sanding and the staining of it. Let me just give you all a little look at the, the operation of it. About to do a little light sanding and staining it. Some of the products that you're gonna need for this for doing this is a little foam brush. This is for the staining. The stain is golden golden oak. This here is my um gloss polyurethane the brush for it a little bit of tin is in the can never tried this before I saw it I say let me pick it up this is the I did a um a little test of what it should look like when I'm done and this is the stain put it up against here and it's pretty close good enough for me all right um Another thing I want to talk about is my um, lights that I'm planning to put in. I'm going with some um, T12 Atenix and I'm only using it because I got it with the tank and just say let me try it out, see how the corals respond to it and um, my plans for the future is either to go with some LEDs Atenix, I see they um, Rapid LED has some of them now or some T5s but you know in this hobby the budget you gotta watch your budget so I'm gonna try this out for now they're gonna be going on I mean these little perch right there right there four of them to rest them on they going in there and the LED is gonna hang somewhere up here to slide out and everything so wish me luck I'm going for it oh and let me give you all the little update on um the dr. Tim's one and only and guys I gotta tell you this is I think day 15 right now and I haven't seen no significant raise in ammonia only on day 9 it raised a point two five I think and went back down in day 10 so right now from since day 10 till day 15 I'm seeing zero ammonia zero nitrite and zero nitrates zero so guys I'm going straight down I'm gonna keep testing it every day every day and I will let you all know my honest opinion and so far I think the thing man the thing works it works hands down the proof is in the pudding it works all right so if you all need any other further clarification feel free to shout me a message on it and I will tell you all how it's doing and whatever and even if I see any significant change I'm gonna come back on and tell you the truth that if it works or doesn't work or whatever issue I get in the future don't anticipate of getting any but hey all right so wish me luck I'm about to dive into this so give me one second So 
so the one second actually turned into five days <laughs> I'm actually at day 20 I think and this is how my staining project came out looks pretty good I'm in love with this thing even more and I hope you like it too let me give you all a little closer look of how I did the interior and the electricals and everything let me turn off the lights so these are the authentic T12s which I'm gonna hopefully in the future turn into T5s or LEDs excuse the little mess in the back there I haven't uh, fastened down these two wires yet because I plan on putting my LED drivers on that framing brace right there and I'm not sure how I'm going about it so I say let me leave that out for now Everything else more or less been fastened down. It looks pretty good. Stain the inside. I gave it one coat of clay. And uh, this face here got about two or three coats. So this is the project. 90% done. I haven't put the LEDs in yet because I still got my all my livestock and everything over there, my corals that need the LED. So I couldn't put it in. But after this video, I think I'm gonna start the process of bringing over the livestock and just install the LEDs into the to this canopy. Another thing that I wanted to touch on is that I um, recorded the last few days of the tank parameters and everything, proud to say, is still at zero. So I think at this point it is safe for me to really bring over my livestock and start decorating the tank with nice corals and fish and everything all right so stay tuned for that process I'm about to install the apex controller too and go from there exciting more videos to come and look forward to it this is bike boss signing out